Hi everyone, welcome back to another Shiny Bright Doggo video. I'm Janine, behind the camera is Laura, and today we are going to Unique in Union, New Jersey. This is like our favorite spot to go thrifting. But before we go jump in there, there's a few things I want to update everyone on. First of all, hopefully everyone had a happy and healthy holiday. Um, we this this is a uh, for us right now. It's right before Christmas, but uh, for you guys and us present, it's after Christmas, after the holidays. Something we want to update everyone on is that in January we will be taking two weeks off. So the first two weeks of January, um, there will be no videos, and then for the rest of January, like after those two weeks. We'll be doing one upload per week until February. We're going to come back better than ever normal uh, schedule. with our normal schedule of two videos a week. Um, but yeah, we're just going to take a little break, enjoy the new year, and hopefully all of you will um, enjoy it as well. Yeah, we appreciate you guys. You know, it's been two years. Yeah. And I don't think we've taken a break longer than a week. A week maybe, yeah. Not so, much of a break. So. We appreciate your patience and... Um, I think that's that's it, right? We will be back though. Oh yeah, February we'll be back. <laughs> Two videos a week, normal schedule. Yeah. We're just taking a little break in January to come up with some great new ideas for the mm -hmm. new year. Yeah, and we will have one video, like I said, one video a week right. after our first initial break. two week break. Yep. Let's go thrifting. Let's go. Look at that, it's older Tramp. Right, he looks older. Um, He's $10. He's not that old. No? no? I guess he's not that old. I thought he looked older. Probably in the past 10 years. Okay. Because it's like Disney store. Mm. Halloween. Wow. The Scream Factory. That's really cool. That matches one of the ones I picked up like this past month. Yeah? You know that little house? I think so. That's really cool. Does that have a price on it? Oh. No price? Nope. Of course not. Look, Janine. It's a little, um, I don't know his name, but he's from An American Tale 1986. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. So Do you want this for Christmas? No, thank you. Okay. <laughs> Isn't it? It's like it's brand cute. new, too. It has a zipper, too, which is cool. Uh, maybe 1986. Had, uh, candy or something in it. Probably. That's cool. Janine, look. Oh, wait, actually, don't look. I need to get this free for Christmas. <gasps> Classic wow. marbles. For four dollars. Green is twenty-five off, I believe. So it's three dollars. Here you go, Janine. My gift to you is finding this at the thrift store for you to buy for yourself. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm done shopping for you. <gasps> Better be, it's only a few days till Christmas. Also look at that a little ghost boo plate. Look at him. He's cute. Made in China. Nineteen ninety six though. He's technically almost vintage. No, Give him a few years. Right? Uh, yeah, he's vintage. Oh, right? we, 20 years, right? Yeah. Oh my Give god, he's vintage. Back. Oh my gosh. I just had like an existential crisis here. I know, I am showing my age. Is it toy time? Well, shouldn't we go down? Are you saying I'm for me? Wait, what? I'm confused. Are we going to, to the toys? Yes, I will. Okay. Uh, I don't know if you're saying like... I'm sort of, I guess I'm sort of saying I want to go to the toys. Oh, okay. Look, Janine, pumpkin leaf bags. Halloween, peek it out. Here's a Snoopy for $6. Joker Snoopy. He's made in China. Interesting. Yeah, he's sort of cute. Look at that guy. Oh, he's fun. He has a like a musical compartment in him. I bet he's Press saying happy hand. birthday. <gasps> oh. oh, no, he just like. Oh no, he does. Yeah, I guess he sings, but he also like chuckles yeah, really scarily. Real scary. Yeah, yeah, nothing. Um, no other plush really, unless this guy, Janine. Let's see. Yeah, look at this guy. He's from 1984. What's his name? Oh, Opus. Is... He looks like a club penguin. No, oh, does he's he? He's cute. 1985 on him, and he's how much? Six dollars. Is he? A... He's a Deacon. Is he I a, think he's um... a cartoon strip. Yeah, right. He has a comic strip. Something like that. Yeah. 
he's cute and then what else is here i thought i saw something maybe not um did i see something not that oh i saw this face but that's nothing interesting i think that's it for the plush as i continue to look Easter bunny troll hole. It's um, ten dollars. Ten dollars. Yankees. No thanks. I think um I see something exciting. Yeah? Yeah. Where? Come. Arthur, Arthur Fabric. How cute. Isn't that fun? It's ten dollars. It'd actually be seven fifty. Isn't that adorable? So and then there's also dragon tails. Eight dollars. That's really cool. This is like a um, what's oh. this material called? Um, flannel. Flannel. Yep. This is flannelly. And some one hundred and one Dalmatians. Also some Raggedy Ann and I'm Andy. Show you this one. Oh, that's and cool. Isn't this one too? Huh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. That's really cool. Interesting. Oh look, more Arthur. Where? And right there, it's DW. Wow, that's cool. I wonder if they're worth anything, but really cool to see. What is that? It's like ceramic? No, it's iron. Like iron? Oh. Wow. Only $10. I don't know what's doing in the toy section, though. <laughs> is he older? I was just looking at those on eBay. Is he an older one? Looks probably uh, more modern, but... I don't know, look at that tag. Do they typically have years? I don't oh, know. Oh, I don't know. It's a mystery. Gotta try and wiggle it. Wait, what? 1991? 1991, Laura. I had a right? feeling. Uh, yes. 1991, that's an original. Oh. Yeah. The bag is pink. 3.99. Pink is 50% off? Yeah, pink is 50% off. What oh, do you think? Cute. Just one of them, I think, though. Yeah. Oh. 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 Look, guys, Richard Scary's Cars and Trucks and Things That Go. How cute. Let's see. It has a D in it. Oh, looks like it's falling apart a bit. Um. This one looks like it's from 1974, so definitely older. Jean and I really like Richard Scary. I think it's really cute, the illustrations. How fun. Look at these, these look older too. Walt Disney's America. Wow. Nineteen sixty five. Interesting. There's actually a few here. Different stories, I guess. Interesting. So there's this one. And then stories from other lands. And I love when I'm recording and talking to myself and somebody's like standing right next to me and I don't realize, so I took the books and ran. Um I found these really cool Disney books, Janine. Oh yeah? Yeah. So the so the other one I was talking about. A second ago was this Fantasyland one, which is really cool. These are from 1965. Here are the three. Yeah, this Fantasyland one. Uh, look, there's a lot of pages missing. They're ten dollars each too. But look at that. Great for junk journaling. Mm -hmm. Isn't that cool? That's too bad that so much of the book is gone. Wow. I found some other books you might like, Janine. Yeah. Yeah. I found um, Santa Paws <laughs> on Christmas Land. Yeah. <laughs> um, For yourself? No. <laughs> oh. And then I found a Fear Street. Oh. But I think it might be a reprint. I'm not entirely sure. And I also found... It just fell out of my hands. Oh. <laughs> and lastly, I found Scary Stories for Stormy Nights. Do you have this one? I think I do, but I don't know if I have that cover. Yeah. It looked familiar. And um, I think this is from the 90s too, 1995.
I thought that was cool. This is from 2005. 2005. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna look these up just because I'm curious um, if they're collectible. I've never really seen them before, the Disney books, but I thought that was pretty cool. After a little searching, these are not like crazy collectible. They're actually pretty common on eBay, which I would not have thought given their age, but pretty cool to see, but not something to pick up to flip. Look what I found. It's the Burger King Slammers keychain for 99 cents. 25 cents off. It's a good one. Janine, look what I found. I found some ornaments in here and I think they're the type that our good friend Gina from Hollywood Haunter has been on the lookout for. Really? With these little um, hooks at the top. Yeah, I think these are a little bit older, maybe from the 70s, 60s. I'm not sure, but I thought she was on the lookout for them, so. You should um, um, ask her. I might have to ask her. Oh, $3 for the bag, good price. What? Oh, wow, Looney Tunes uh, Another puzzle. Another Looney Tunes puzzle. Wow. Did you sell the other one already or not yet? No. Not this yet. one's 500 pieces, so I don't oh, want to put those down. I don't want to count that. I have to count all those. <laughs> Look at that. Rescuers, Rescuers down, down under. 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 <laughs> under, 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 under. Rescuers. Uh, <laughs> Rescuers down under. Very cool. <laughs> I can't talk. A Snoopy Halloween Rubik's Cube. Isn't that fun? That's fun. I do like that. Um, do we have anything else here? Have you found anything else, Janine? Or is that it for so far? Oh, old dog, dog, dog toy. toy for Olive for New Christmas. Tag. Very nice. She'll love that. What's up? Found Pikachu? a Pikachu? Yeah. Older Pikachu? I can't tell. These oh, tracks been cut off. Yeah. Seems, uh, he looks yeah. a little older. He's cute. He's very, like, loved, though. Yeah, isn't he cute, though? Yeah, he's cute. Janine, look at these things I found. This Halloween candy container things. I can't tell how old they Zombie are. Screamers? Yeah. There's like they don't a, have a... No, I couldn't find a date on them. Aren't they cool though? There's like a goblin they and are. a zombie. They look a little bit older to me. They do. Right? Look, yeah, they look like 2000s. Yeah. I thought you would like that. I think she likes it. She's just trying to figure out what date they are. Um, but then, like, oh wait, what about be... on the back of the battery compartment? Does I it looked say? at that. Yeah, I looked at that. Tricky. Hmm. We think they're a little bit newer, maybe even from the 2010s. Um, but still sort of cool. $4 yeah, for are. the bag would be $3. She may get it, she may not. I know. I might get it, I might not. I don't know. I also found this Anna Lee oh, for $1.99. Anna Lee mouse. That's cute. Yeah. And I also, I went back to look at the ornaments and I found some cool things I want to show you. Oh, really? I found this bag of ornaments, which look pretty normal, but then I spotted these like flower ones in the different colors. Those are pretty. The orange and the pink. Isn't that fun? Mm -hmm. And they do have a smaller cap like that, which indicates that it's definitely an older ornament. It's probably from, if I had to guess by the colors and looks, probably from the 60s. Wow. Um, probably made in a European country like Poland or Czechoslovakia. I just thought they were so cool. Have you ever seen ones like that? No, they're really pretty. I might have to pick it up. The bag is only $3, so I think it's a pretty good score. Santa on a UFO with Rudolph. And you plug it in and the lights light up. Oh, that's so fun. I love that. Isn't that cool? Yeah. And look. Baby Yoda. Found a baby Yoda. Look at him. Looks like Olive. He is really cool. Who is he? I don't know, but look at that thing. Like he, did you press it? He made noise or something? His eyes light up. Is there anything on the bottom of his feet? An old sticker. But it's not like, hmm. Interesting. Maybe we could do a little Google Lens. It might be yeah, hard though, because he's just, just Frankenstein. Come up Frankenstein. That's cool though. The only thing I got from the thrift store were these really cool ornaments I showed you guys. After further inspection, they are plastic, which I thought was really interesting. You can see the paint is sort of flaking mm. off on some of them. Um, but I do think they're still older. I think now, looking at them, they're probably from the 70s. But really cool. They have great colors. They have those smaller caps. And when I took a look in the bag, there were also some just like older ornaments that were more plain, which is really cool. So these classic one colored bulbs um, were also in the bag and they do have the smaller caps as well. And these actually say Poland on them. That's a great country to look out for if you're looking for ornaments that are from like the 60s, very early 70s. Um, so it was a great bag to find. And I still really do love those floral ornaments. Great that they're plastic because they won't break, but they're just so cool and retro looking. So Janine, you picked up this toy for Olive, which mm -hmm. we will gift to her for Christmas. It's a cute little, I guess, lemur? 
All right. Yeah, okay. I don't know. Monkey? I don't know what it is. It's cute, though. It is cute. And Janine also picked up this Frankenstein. We have not been able to figure out what company he was made by, what he does. He does have this really interesting back compartment. It yeah. looks like it would make sound, right? Yeah, I think his eyes light up, too. See how uh -huh. they're, like, bulbs? We yeah. haven't been able to, like, pry it open or anything, but... If you guys have any idea, let us know. He's really cute, even if he's just like a figurine that stands up. But it was a fun day at the thrift store. It was right before Christmas, so a lot of fun. And we have one more video for you guys this year. And then again, we're taking a quick little break in the new year. But we hope everyone had a happy and healthy holiday. Thanks for joining us, guys. See you next time. Bye. Bye.